What, what up, up fam? fam and welcome back to our channel i'm deb and i'm jess and before we get into much today make sure you subscribe hit that bell to be notified we drop monstrous eats like these welcome back it is such a treat grab your plate fam come on let's eat so before we get into much today shall we pray father god we thank you for everyone that is joining us today we pray for the food we pray that you bless those that prepared it those that prepped it to come to us we also pray for humility because in some moments we all may have turns where we could go and be arrogant, but let's remain humble and walk more like you. So, in your son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. If you're new to the channel, we've got construction workers, so you might hear them sprinkled Anybody? periodically. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's get the video to 1K likes, shall we? Yeah. We've been doing pretty good, so let's continue the train. Right now. Yes. Thumbs up like the video. The video Please. Then come back in and <clears throat> watch us. Munch these bush down. Yes. So what we got to eat is pretty much self-explanatory. Yes. Loaded nachos. Loaded with the works. How y'all doing with y'all? You know, let us know down below. Shout out to y'all. We love y'all. Yeah. Know everybody love us eating nachos. So Taco nacho, no Tuesday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we are starving like Marvin. Say what you want to say about the phrase starving, but we ain't really ate since day four yesterday, so we're starving. Like Marvin, and how many? The three hunger hostages. I used to go over and say like six or something like that. About six. Mm hmm. We got meat, cheese, sour cream, Don Don, legs. Pico. Jalapenos. Back out of Pretty much a wide variety. Mm-hmm. Not shy on toppings. Mm-mm. Taco sauce. We got regular chips today though. No kind of mix, mix some of the calories. And the heat. I wanted some jalapenos. Oh. Yeah. We can do the hot chips. And jalapenos. I feel you. Too much hot. Done, done. Shaking the table, y'all. It was shaking the table. Hmm. <laughs> I remember when we used to have that insert. I remember when I seen it on TV. Boy, yeah. It was so amusing. <laughs> Man, people's Can't personalities. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. She always be crazy. Man. Admittedly and perceptually. Mm-hmm. <laughs> She'll tell you in a minute. Hey. I'm crazy. You better leave me alone. <laughs> Cause it's truly what you want right now. And just like that Man. sometimes, especially when you're sharing your life and you're sharing things that are so personal. Mm-hmm. When people pull little moments and try to flip them out of context. And make the mean make it mean what they want it to mean instead of what it is. True. That's so crazy. So it's kinda of like you're writing a book and someone comes in and makes unauthorized edits and get mad when you say, Hey, mm -hmm. you're not an editor for this book. I used to think reality TV was real. At what age did you come to the realization it wasn't? Mm. Maybe when I got with you and you start seeing certain stuff when I be watching stuff. All right, babe. 
That is not real. Why do you say that? And what you say was like, hmm. And I started looking at certain stuff like where people be certain in certain uh, places. Like, there ain't no coincidence. Yes, strategic. They told them where it was going to be at. Mm -hmm. Or they refilmed it. Mm hmm. I ain't never think about nothing like that. That they refilm stuff. Mm hmm. Take it that far. I heard Andy show. You should be good. Uh, well, there may be real moments for the most part. It's for ratings. Mm -hmm. A couple of um, hotels. Mm -hmm. I remember one day I saw a comment someone said I was playing with the nachos <sighs> and to that I say what? but you gotta realize some people want to see you just eat fast but if you are eating to eat the faster you eat the fuller you'll get faster Mmm. Because when you eat fast, that's definitely why you're food. gasping in air. So that's why you have to burp and shift them around and, and stuff like that. I be scarfing down my food when you get real hungry. Yep. You like, you be like, oh. That's why I definitely try to get Ooh. also better with talking between bites. Instead of white. Mm hmm. Although some people may see it as extra. Life is about strategy. You're so crazy. Your no, ass just work good like that. <laughs> good had strategies. To. They've had to. Mm -mm. Because you don't adapt to a situation in the moment, like not even sink or swim, sink. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's been like that most of my life, praise me. So, you've almost mastered it. <laughs> Strategies. Like how people say, if you can go Ooh. back and meet someone, talk to someone outside of people saying they're parent Jesus and things like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's be real. Unless. That's done, done, y'all. So, like I was saying, unless. You have any doubts about anything in regards to Jesus going back and meeting Jesus would do nothing for you. Mm -hmm. Because you already have the faith that's there. I mean, the most you could do is refortify what you already had. What if you just want to ask him something though? Like. Mm hmm. But if you're supposed to see him, if you do the right things, then as long as you do the right things, then you can we'll ask see that him and I can ask him when I get there. Yes. <laughs> Why waste something on something that's, that should, as long as you're doing right in life, should already be guaranteed? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> because you also don't know how another person lives mm -hmm. to know that they're going to be where you're going. Before you can ask them, mm -hmm. so you might as well just go back and ask somebody else. Mm -hmm. Something or ask or whatever. Mm -hmm. I get you. See, well, that's, that's just my thought process. I get that makes sense. You do. People was like, but I got to see. Mm-hmm. Mm. But I got to know. 
<laughs> I will see Jesus when I get there and say, Lord, I was wondering, you know, I had an opportunity to ask you this, but you already <laughs> know how that went. Uh -huh. Hello, how you doing? I'm sure you know who I'm is. And I'm sure you know <laughs> I'll come with this question. <laughs> People often pondered, what was the meaning of life? I ain't worried about that part. When you were walking down here in our shoes, and you were experiencing the things that you were experiencing. Don't be down there, what are you doing? <laughs> what kind of things on earth besides prayer mm -hmm. and like fellowship Brought you solace. Like, what were your, what were some, what were some things that you enjoyed doing? Like, the like comfort. If Jesus liked to play basketball. Or because I wasn't in time, so I don't know what the sport may have been. But yeah, yes, that variation like that. of basketball. Yes. Like, to get to know. I'm just saying. Him because like we know. Mm -hmm. Especially on if, another level. Because if the Lord is our Father, mm -hmm. in extension. Jesus would be like a big brother. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so why not get to know my big brother outside of a commercial level? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> because most of what we know is the journey that he went to on the road to his assignment. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. There were 33 years mm -hmm. leading up to that. What were some of the things you did in preparation? Like, you know that I got so many, I got so many questions. Like, I'll but be I ain't stuck. going back for that. I'd be stuck. Ask somebody else something. Like where your bloodline started it or something. Thank you. That's what I say. I feel you. Or go back, especially if Man. you're someone in your. In your genealogy, genealogical pool that you don't know, have no idea mm -hmm. where that came from. If you go to the start, then you can at least know. That's another level. Mm-hmm. But those are kind of thoughts I have. <laughs> Definitely something. Yeah, it's something I want to know or ask. But stuff like that is also why I think about going to school for philosophy, though. It's just a lot of the, the good schools for it. They're in different areas, like one of the top schools in New York. That's a lot of schools in New York. Mm-hmm. For different stuff. Mm-hmm. Not just universities. I see why we be going there. Man. I'm and that was exactly what I, what I, without <laughs> It's okay. That was exactly what I was about to say. It's a sad thing that a lot of the different I like different fields and different tracks. I didn't even really get introduced to a lot of them until I'd already decided and mm -hmm. went down one that I was already just pretty much good at that was a way to get by in life in the hobby. Definitely. Mm -hmm. mm. So mm -hmm. what you gonna say? Mm -mm. I was gonna change the subject so finish what you oh. gonna say. I was gonna say I can um, I can definitely see why people go back to school at later years in life because for me um, mm -hmm. as soon to be 33 I'm like you know what my bachelor's in accounting and business administration while that was something that I was comfortable and I could get by with mm -hmm. that's more something that I enjoy so it's hobby pastime at this point like where do I want to be when I grow up you <laughs> On a different level, you know? Yeah. I thought I wanted to be what I wanted to be when I grew up. 
I didn't want to be that no more. I had to grow up to see mm -hmm. what I wanted to be when I grow up. <laughs> oh, I know that sounds crazy, but y'all know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Because like with being grown and living life, like mm -hmm. having five years active in the Marine Corps. Some people definitely knew what they wanted to be though. They yeah. stuck with it and still like it. But that's what I'm saying. I, they also probably comb through a lot of different ones or it's like a family, um, like a family career track. Mm -hmm. Like Pastor Mike, how his father's a pastor. He He's pastoring, his mm -hmm. brother's pastoring. Mm -hmm. You know, there's something just off the wall happens in there or out of the blue happens in their bloodline his children, seeing the kind of examples that they have, unless they just go straight left, they probably will lean toward pastoring. Mm -hmm. A lot of musicians, their kids, musicians. True. Excuse me. So sometimes some people's careers are based off, well, their passions in life are based on seeing things they grew up. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I definitely did that. And especially if you can get a slice of heaven in the house and you grow up and you feel like it's heaven all your life, why would you want not want to share what your perception of that would be with the world? Especially if you had a parent that did it in an efficient and effective manner. I'm not lying. And I'm full. I'm not full, but I'm full. I think I need to. Shift and readjust. Mm -hmm. Stand up or slow down. How y'all doing, fam? I know we was talking, running out of chatterboxes and eating this food. But we hope y'all been doing well. If your birthday was in April like me, shout out to you. Happy birthday to all the April babies out there with them Aries and Taurus. <coughs> Excuse me. So April babies were on or around like June to July conception. <laughs> so happy birthday, hot girl summer babies. Uh, I'm weak. Don't do that. <laughs> Somebody but been around. in there cutting the water on it off. Mm -hmm. I bet it's gone gone. Mm-hmm. Undone. But her girl summer has always been around. It's just been having different names and it's been different based on region. Mm. I'm doing too. Like in like in some regions you have the freak nick. In some areas you have the booty bowls. I mean we the foot wash. Mm-hmm. Why have you shut up? Damn. Oh. Mm. You're magnet for kick. Was about ready to love? Mm mm. Mm. It was about them. Oh, yes. Okay. We done watched them almost two times. We on the second time. Probably will watch it one more time. Yes, it was pretty good. On what that thing called? Uh -huh. Amazon Prime. Mm -hmm. mm hmm. It was pretty good. Pretty scary. Suspenseful for me. I can't say what it was for you. I'm saying I'm speaking for my own self. I then I bad scared. This was not, especially when we went back the second time. Mm -hmm. and I saw, mm -hmm. But especially when we went back the second time and I saw all the stuff that I didn't see the first time, like mm -hmm. and I knew. Still scared. Definitely give you. Jump vibes. When you come at you, Mister. Ma'am. <laughs> we know that you not scared. I have a baby like you can go pick that up like a hamburger. But I can't remember what I was gonna tell y'all. Other than it was good, and I definitely check it out, and I definitely watch it again. And definitely wow. gave me Hill House vibes. 
Mm-hmm. Get out vibes. Who else? Um, us. Mm-hmm. Um, who else? Oh, American Horror Story. Mm-hmm. And we the definitely feel like style. season two will not be the same people. Especially like Hill House. Because I'm not going to spoil it too much, but if they make it about the same people, it will have to be a backstory. Mm-hmm. Because that's just that on that. Well, maybe we'll see they next, well they next, everybody next moves off. That's boring. Mm-hmm. <laughs> because. You wanna see thing, where everybody ends up? No. Give me something new. Because it wasn't, if you were looking at it, it wasn't about them. Mm-hmm. So they would have to pull stuff out of the air that wasn't even going on during what we already saw in order for us to see where they're going. Hmm. That's why I say that'd be boring. They'd have to create a whole new storyline, change the story and everything. <laughs> that'd be lame. I'm gonna start keep popping my mouth. Oh man. Okay, now I'm full. Because it's hot. Hmm. Oh, what's your mouth? Yeah. Just because I'm still eating does not mean that it's not spicy because I'm sweating, but it's not unbearable. Bam. Yes. It's over. Hey <laughs> y'all, it was just the biggest freaking ant. Stop screaming in the fam, you're done done. Get out the water. Mute. Every time I tell him, we be playing Paul's mute. And every time I tell him mute, he think it's so funny. And can you say hey to the fans? Say hey. How you say hey, you mute it. Mm -hmm. Right. Mute. Mm -hmm. you confuse me. But yes, y'all. That was a, was that a fire ant? Yes. A black one at that. I ain't never had a ant that be crawling me before. I had to take two step on it. We been seeing a whole bunch of ants. Ant in the shower. Of the, what they call them? Sugar ants. <laughs> they ate all my little sugar wash. I was <laughs> saying, it's that sugar screw up. Yeah. But only in our bathroom, maybe because I have bathroom by the backyard. I don't know. And it's your sugar scrub. No, they used to stay their asses outside. I would take a shower. Well, fam, one of the young ones, it woke from their slumber. So, babe, I went to go tend to him. I'm going to eat a few more bites and then I'm going to be out of here. I'm not sure, so yeah, y'all. I just don't understand. So, what's new in your world? Something good and positive, I hope. Because there's so much. It's hardening stuff going on out there in the world today. <laughs> Them little feet be pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter patter. You could not tell our children that. The house is not tracked. What you doing, Dun Dun? 
You're not dressed. You wanna pull up, boy? You something else. You know that, dog, dog. Anybody ever told you that? Hmm. Hey. What? B C D. Goodbye, wasn't it? Thank you, son. This most definitely good. Mm -hmm. You didn't even have it. How do you know it's not good? See, you don't even know. Do you? Who told you then? He be capping. You baby cap. Snapple is remaking the bottles and they're increasing the juice percentage in them. That's a noticeable difference to me at least. Jazz swears they taste the same for her so I know for me it tastes totally different. Tell you, having children is truly just a joy and a blessing, brother. Where's your eye? Where's your head? Where's your nose? What about your mouth? You gonna dig in your nose and then put him out here on nasty. <laughs> Don't put your finger in there. It's gross. How many of you parents out there that have sons and daughters and experiencing the two feel like your daughters? Huh? You say what? Tried it. Well, sadly, we're about to get ready to wrap up, y'all. Hmm? 
What about baby? Bush baby? Little lion. Happy, happy hippo. Well, sadly we have come to the point in the video where we must let you guys go. So, until the next video fam, love you guys, stay safe, stay blessed, be that life for someone else to emulate because you never know what your kind of words and gestures could do for the next person day.